You got Lou Williams stopping by Magic <laughs> oh, City. Boy. You got Lou Williams stopping by Magic City down there in Atlanta. And I will say, to be fair to Lou Williams, okay, I'm not saying that just because he was out on a family emergency uh, that what he did was right. Okay, I would never say that, especially because he's a 16-year vet and you potentially jeopardize a lot of things for your team, which is the Clippers, which are very deep and could go on a real run here. But, hey, if I'm in Atlanta and I want some wings and I'm either going to a funeral or something like that and I want to feel good, I'm going to go to the place that I know has the best damn wings. And as an 18-year-old, I went into Magic City with Pac-Man Jones and I was forced to eat some of these wings. And I'll tell you what, those wings are the truth. <laughs> they are so good. As... As being somebody who has been the only white person in a black uh, uh, adult ballet before, mm. numerous occasions, there's a couple drawbacks. Okay, you're always going to get attacked by the biggest dancer. <laughs> okay, and, and unless you want to be a mean guy, which I am not, there's going to be there's going to be a situation that comes at every time where you got to go like, oh, I'm so sorry. I mean, I'm just here for the wings or, or whatever. You know what I mean? There's going to be that conversation. But you, the the food aspect, I think a lot of whites don't fully understand. The food at black strip clubs is elite. Like it's not just like a game. It's not something that's said. This is the menu from Magic City. And this now, granted, Magic City's wings were the first black strip club I was ever at that I had wings where I was like damn these are unbelievable wings but as I became older and went to more I realized that this is a part of it like this is a real thing so I can't blame Lou Williams for wanting the best wings that he's ever had in his life potentially but boy this is going to be a tough look for him the NBA and the Clippers to kind of get over because if you look about old whites right you get a strip club whenever he gets out there it's like well potentially the people that were dancing while he was having his wings we're nude, I would assume. Mm -hmm. You could see a little twerking and ass shaking and slapping and clapping, but the wings that he was eating, well, let's not undersell how delicious those things also were. I mean, ah! So sorry to interrupt. If you're a man watching this, you deserve to have long, great and you can do that now with our friends at Roman. Right now, you go to GetRoman.com. You get $10 off and free two-day shipping on Roman Swipes, which are guaranteed to make you have longer, more fulfilling every time you get in the sack. Now, let's get back to the fornicate in action. As a wing lover, I cannot have anything bad to say about Lula. He's got a wing on the menu named after him. I mean, the guy just went through a family tragedy, and all he does is want to get some comfort wings. And he's going to go to the place that has a wing named after him on the menu. Lou Will Lemon Pepper Barbecue, I would assume, is going to be their hottest seller for what? <laughs> the next 10 years? I, and I think Magic City, the kitchen, Magic City Kitchen had a big weekend on social media. Uh, and I would assume that their business is about to go up. And they do DoorDash, they said. I saw that. Oh, really? So Lou, see? Hey, hey. So they kind of came out too. This Jack Harlow guy who I didn't even know existed should get popped in the mouth, by the way. <laughs> okay, I don't know what you're doing. Obviously, you're trying to take down the entire NBA, Jack. Let's take it easy. But I guess he's a good rapper from Louisville. I listened to a couple of his songs. He is a good rapper. But I think rules like 1 through 15 when going through a pandemic and being in a strip club and person you're with in a strip club is going back to a bubble is don't take a selfie mm -hmm. with that person. But hey, you got to flex when you got to flex. I wish he had a wing in that photo. Oh, like, yes. like I wish Lou had a wing in there so this would all get justified a little bit more.